Welcome back, you guys, to the Renee of Paris YouTube channel. My name is Marcy from Wig Obsessed. Today we're looking at Renee of Paris Amori Collection Topper 2024 Spring Collection. This is in the gorgeous color NM Mochachina R, which stands for Natural Movement Mochachina Rooted. Such a pretty color, you guys. If you are not utilizing toppers within your alternate hair toolbox, let me tell you why you should. And that is because toppers bring versatility. They do come with a few additional considerations that wigs do not because wigs can totally change your look. Toppers must utilize your bio hair. So you must keep your color selection for toppers within the same color family as your bio hair. And you can see that this one matches my bio hair well enough that it will blend. There's lots of dimension in this hair. There is lots of dimension in my bio hair. They are gonna blend seamlessly and look amazing. And I wanna thank Renee of Paris for sending me this one. I didn't choose her. I didn't choose this color. They knew my bio hair. They were able to select for me and I think they did an excellent job. Looking at the inside of her cap, you can see a full mono top and you can see that she has wefting around the perimeter. She also has pressure sensitive clips that surround the perimeter, which allow you to connect this topper to healthy bio hair. So one of the main considerations when selecting a topper is that you choose a cap large enough that it covers any area of sparseness well enough so that these clips can connect to healthy hair. And the beauty of a topper is it brings fullness to your bio hair by covering your areas of thinning hair. It's a wonderful thing. Okay, let's take a look at her. So she has a side swept bang that's going to just blend beautifully with my bio hair. This topper has different layers, right? So a bang, a face framing layer, and then it just kind of tapers out into just really nice longer layers. Okay, let's try her on. So I'm going to pull her up to about my natural hairline. Make sure I've got her far enough forward. So you do the four finger trick to know exactly where to place your alternative hair. And I think this looks great right here. So I'm gonna reach underneath and gently connect these pressure sensitive clips to my healthy bio hair. I'm holding it flat on top, which is just giving me a secure connection point. I think we've done it. I think that's all she needs. Okay, so like I said, these little bangs around the face just gradually layer down till my bio hair is peeking out beneath. And I think it looks lovely. This topper is not the exact same length as my bio hair, but it doesn't have to be because it just blends really well. I am absolutely loving that I have learned all about toppers and their benefits and how they just add to my alternative hair toolkit. This is just one more bit of secret sauce that I have, and that is toppers. So, so pretty. This is part of the natural movement collection and it is not a heat friendly fiber. You do not wanna apply heat to this hair. And always my styling tip for you guys, if you need to comb through this hair, be sure to do it with a wide tooth comb. You don't wanna use a bristled brush on a synthetic wig. I hope this tutorial was helpful to you as you consider or perhaps pursue additional toppers. There is no reason to be intimidated by toppers. You just need to learn a little bit about them and understand the pros and cons and the special considerations. And they are a wonderful asset to your alternative hair collection. Love them. 
Thank you so much for joining me today on the Renea Perez YouTube channel. My name is Marcy and we'll talk soon.